This is a quick video on how to test your brake fluid with one of these. It's uh, about 10 bucks on Amazon. You can look it up. There's a couple different manufacturers. They all appear to be about the same. It has two little probes on the end of it that you dip down into the brake fluid, and then it gives you an instant reading of how much water is in the brake fluid. And that gives you an indication of, uh, of the health and uh, whether or not you need to have it changed. Um, so anyway, uh, I'll show you how to get in there and test it. And you know, I haven't tested mine, so we'll see if uh, we'll see where mine uh, falls on this little scale here. So let's get to it. On this car, the brake uh, reservoir is right up under this cowling. So we'll go ahead and just remove this and brake fluid and paint do not mix. So you do want to uh, be careful. Well, where you uh, put the cap, where you uh, don't drip brake fluid on your paint. So all we're gonna do is, uh, according to the instructions, push the thing to turn it on and dip this in, and it'll immediately give you a reading. And you can see I'm way up over 4%, uh, which is kind of alarming, but uh, test it one more time. Almost, yeah, way up in the 4% range. So, um, if you follow my channel here, you'll know, you know, of course I didn't bring a paper towel over here. That's kind of annoying. Um, so if you follow my channel, you'll know that I uh, just did my brakes. So I have the car at the dealer uh, coming up in um, next week to have new tires put on and I will uh, go ahead and have them uh, flush and replace the brake fluid while I'm there. So stay tuned. We'll get a video going of that. But uh, for this purpose, this is how you test the brake fluid in uh, just about any car. So for 10 bucks, you can uh, either save yourself or uh, know that you need to uh, have your fluid changed. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe.